Hello everyone, it's Eva with Polished After 60. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. So guys, in today's video, I have a try-on from a company, an online retailer by the name of Roswe, and they sent me some dresses to try on. So if you're interested um, in taking a look at what I have, stay tuned, I'll be right back. All right, everyone, welcome. Welcome back to my channel. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Yvette. The channel is Polished After 60, and I go over topics for the more mature woman, fashion of all types, affordable um, fashion, a little bit higher end fashion, um, online shopping and shopping at your um, favorite mall. Um, I uh, do videos having to do with um, lifestyle and beauty, just a little bit of everything. So um, I hope you enjoyed today's video. The lighting is a little bit off today. It's super bright outside. I'm trying to get the writing, the lighting um, to be okay. So I hope you guys uh, understand. But anyway, as I said, Roswe contacted me. They wanted to send me a couple of their dresses and I never say no. Um, typically what I do is um, I will keep some items and then I uh, will gift some items. I will pay those items um, forward, if you will. Uh, so they are offering a discount with the code KOL10 uh, for any of you who might spend over $49, um, but you, you will get a 10% discount. But let me back up with this first dress, which I think is quite lovely. I will leave you the links down below. And uh, you think I was going to an occasion, so I think I'm going to have to be invited out so that I can wear this lovely dress. Um, as you can see, it has a little bit of a high-low and it has a bit of a lace detail in the top. Let me move in a little bit closer that you can see. Um, very pretty. I'm very impressed. It's a little bit flowy organza. So if you have a special occasion that you're going to, you might consider going onto their website and checking out to see what they have. So I think I might have a couple of other uh, dressy options and then um, some kind of fun things that I'm unsure about, but um, you be the judge. I will be right back, guys. Hold on. All right, everyone, I am back. So I always seem to choose these colors. Now, I think this was listed as a dusty purple, but it does um, does look a little bit blue and you all know I love blue and forgive me everyone my steam iron is on I don't know what's going on with it but it doesn't want to blow out steam so I have another one on order but I I did need to show you guys this these dresses so let me pull back again a little dress that's good for a little bit more special occasion all the dresses are very reasonably priced um, it has a little bit of a capelet with these sleeves that are very cute they cover up any arm issues that you might have I think it has a very nice fit to it I paired it with a pair of slingback pumps you know that slingbacks are very much on trend so ladies check in your closets and um, start pulling out what you might have available for yourself it does have a little pin enclosure here I would probably um, I don't know if you can remove this um, it has like a little snap but I think I think it would look prettier if you would um, place your own pin on it it's not bad but I think I would place something else here um, when I uh, would wear this particular dress. So hold on, I will be right back, you guys, hold on. I think I have a fun surprise, but stick around, I'll be right back, hold on. Alrighty, ladies, I'm back. So we are seeing an awful lot of these little matched sweater sets and little match sets, and I do like that trend. Houndstooth is one of my all-time favorites. Um, this might be a little bit larger print, 
but I like it. I used to have a pair of slacks. In my working days, I had a pair of houndstooth slacks that I wore all the time, and I loved them with a black turtleneck and a pretty blazer. I thought it was such a sharp look. But anyway, let me back up so that you can see this little outfit. It has the jacket, and then it has a little pair of joggers. Let me back up so that you can take a look. I would probably put on a pair of sneakers with this. I think a pair of white sneakers would be very cute, but I'm getting ready for a trip and I have my, um, my favorite sneakers uh, packed up. So um, I wore a pair of black ballet flats instead. But I think it's a cute and fun look. Um, I especially like that I can wear this little jacket by itself and also wear the joggers by themselves. I think this would look very cute uh, with a pair of black slacks. And uh, yeah, I think that would make a great outfit. And the joggers would probably look very pretty with a black sweater over top, a little oversized sweater, or maybe something closer to the body. But all in all, they sent me some cute pieces. Um, I was expecting to get a few more pieces. I'm not sure. Um, I'm not sure if they are still um, being shipped to me, but as I said, I'm planning a trip, so um, not sure if I'm gonna get those pieces before, before I get off. But anyway, if I get them, I will be sure to share them with you guys. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Hold on, I have one more look, a surprise look for you guys, and um, I will be back. Yeah, hold on. Alrighty guys, I'm back with another blue option. You know I like my blues, guys. So um, I think this uh, dress would be very cute if you worked in an office environment. Um, I think it would be uh, great for that. Um, it's a nice tailored dress and you know we see a lot of tailoring um, going on this year. So a very cute dress. Again, I paired it with my black pumps. Um, although I could see you wearing these with a nude heel as well, uh, maybe a little booty close, close to your ankle. So, um, like those, uh, sweater type, I don't know what they're called. They're the knitted booties. I have a pair, uh, that they're in like a, a cream color. I don't think they would go well with this dress, but if you had a black of slim fitting, booties i think that would be a great option for this dress i think it would be very cute and again very affordable dressing and this is you know dresses are one and done you don't have to worry about anything else whatever you're going to wear as your outerwear and you are out this would look great with a camel coat over it um and a pair of camel shoes maybe i think that would work hold on guys i think i have two more outfits so hold on all right, everyone, I'm back. So, wow, we are seeing a lot of leather and full leather this season. I got me this full leather um, dress in this pretty wine color. You tell me, guys, what you think. Um, I think it's pretty. I am not certain that um, it's for me. I think perhaps with a blazer over top, um, I think it might be better if you hold on a minute maybe I will go ahead and try it on and see what you guys think uh, I don't know it's pretty they had it in a couple of other colors and I just love this wine color for the fall so hold on let me go put on a blazer and I will be back hold on alrighty guys I'm back so I topped the dress with this lovely tweed jacket that I have from Talbis. So a little bit of high low going on. I do think I like this a little bit more. I think it tones down the leather, um, head to toe leather. I'm not quite sure yet if I'm brave enough to try that trend, but I do think that I would wear this um, with a blazer or a jacket over top. Now, it would have to get awfully cold here in Florida for me to be able to wear this outfit, although it is cool out there today in the 60s, I think, when I woke up. But uh, anyway, guys, you tell me what you think about these items that I picked up from Roswell. As I said, they're offering you guys a 10% discount for any purchases over $49. And $49.99, I believe, US. And uh, they are an online retailer. They give you all this. I either got a large or 
think I might have even picked something up in an extra large um, for these items. Um, anytime I purchase things that are um, overseas, even though even though I look at the sizing, I'd rather have something a little bit too big that I can have altered um, if I need to, then you know, not be able to wear it at all. So that's what I did in these case. But um, I think overall, I'm pleased they came very well packaged. Um, of course, anything that you get in the mail will require some ironing or some steam pressing, but uh, we all know how to handle that, right? So I had a lot of fun making this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, I try to give you guys ideas from all different retailers and stores, so keep that in mind whenever I am showing you guys um, items that uh, you might be interested in. Alrighty, so uh, have a wonderful day everyone. Uh, keep safe, stay well, and I will be seeing you again real soon. Bye everyone. Bye.